Hey, what's up, guys? <laughs> what's up, guys? This is the Lighting One, the Lighting One, aka Guys Child, aka Guys Child. This is part two, part two, the breakdown. All right. So, guys, if you smash that like button, I thank you very much. If you are new to this channel, and if you like what I'm about to say or said previously, smash that like button. Hit that like button. Stump on it. Put the elbow on it. The whole nine yards. Okay. So, the previous video about what I've just posted about Gene Deal. This is uh, Gene Deal. This is part two. Part two. All right. So, here's the breakdown. Greg Cady solved the Tupac Biggie murder case. Sat down with Mob James. Sat down with Mob James. What does that mean? Well, Greg Cady is retaliating over what Gene Deal said about his credibility as a cop. Gene Deal says Greg Cady is a crooked cop, a dirty cop, was part of the rampage. And some people feel that Greg Cady purposely was hired only to clear the LAPD of wrongdoing of the murder of Biggie Smalls. Now, Mob James, what did he have to do with it? Why is Mob James sitting at the table? Well, Mob James is right with Greg Cady. Why? I don't know why. But Greg, Mob James have nothing good to say about Gene Deal. All right? In case anybody see it, get a good close-up that shy. All right. So what does this mean, he lighting one? Well, what does it mean now that anything Gene Deal do, anything he say, it could be detrimental to his health. And what do I mean by that? Accidents is going to happen. See, y'all didn't listen to me when I made a video about Gene Deal, you know, saying the breakdown. I said about a month ago, about a month ago, about a month ago, but I said, JD, leave it alone. Now that you got the attention, you pulled on that dragon's tail. You woke up that sleeping giant. Now they are focused on you. So now they are waiting for you to say something. They want you to say something. They dare you to say something. Because, let's go back. This is the breakdown. Why did Mace, murder Mace, Mace, former artist of Bad Boy, who says D cheated him, shitty diddy cheated him, shitty diddy, shitty diddy cheated him, but went on Gene Deal's show, podcast, and said y'all had guns, why you ain't bust back? The security seems shady. Now, according to Gene Deal, he said out of his mouth that there was no security. It was Gene Deal, a driver, and another cop of some sort. So, why didn't Mace say that? Who put Mace up to say that? That made no sense. People came out the woodwork and said, Mace. You wrong, brother. Gene Deal didn't say nothing about you doing the homo stuff. And let me tell y'all about homo stuff. Homo stuff is cool as long as you keep it to yourself. Homo stuff is okay. Keep it away from me. Home <laughs> let me leave the LGTB community alone. Anyway, <laughs> man, Mace was heated, but he never apologized. So now Gene Deal had surgery. And the last video he did, he kind of softened up a little bit. Oh, Mom James, you know I ain't got no beef with you, man. You ain't did that, man. Look. Look. This video is for the hood niggas. The hood bitches out there. Shit is about to get real now. I told you guys this a month ago in my last video. I, what the video about the Gene Deal video? When I said I was going to leave it alone. Go to my catalog, y'all. I can't remember off the top of my head because I do some freestyling stuff. I do freestyle. 
And I said this was going to happen. I said, Gene Deal, leave this alone. So now you got Greg Cady sitting at the table. And he clearly says, Gene Deal stories is inconsistent. Gene Deal stories that keep changing. Gene Deal finger. Now I say this. Gene Deal is a former parole officer. He's permit to carry a firearm. When he said Amir Muhammad was walking towards him and Gene Deal Flashed his weapon, banished his weapon. Banished mean, boop, got a weapon. And Gene Deal looked at him like, sup? And the guy looked at him, peanut head, bow tie, and walked the other direction. Now, does that mean that man was the shooter? Because if you're doing security, a goofball can walk in the door and look at you crazy. And walk out the door. And then your store get robbed. Does that mean that man, that crackhead, robbed the store? No. So now, Gene Neal says that the FBI showed him some pictures. And the face was blurred out. And Gene Neal says, where would you get that picture? Number one, you don't want to fuck with the FBI. The FBI go back to the Marcus Garvey's days. The FBI go back to Malcolm X days. You get my point? Rob Gorbich served eight years for running his damn mouth and just released part of by President Trump. All because he was talking to the FBI, running his mouth. I told y'all this, and I'm telling you this. But y'all don't give me no credit. Oh, you don't know what you talking about. Yeah, 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 free shit. Uh, you don't know what you talking about. Uh, 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 you know what you All right. All right. <laughs> the reason why I stopped relieving, <laughs> relieving, the reason I stopped receiving backlash is because I say, hey, I'm out. I don't want no money. I'm out. I'm done. You can have it. Blah, blah, blah. I'm out. Gene Deal, don't be stupid. Don't be stupid. You are telling more on your videos than in your book. Did he have enough juice to prevent your book deal coming out? The industry, there are powerful people who don't want your book to come out. Do you think these people going to let you publish a book? And it's going to implicate, possibly incarcerate, humiliate people in the industry? I saw a video with uh, G. Dill. He went live with uh, uh, choke, no joke, joke, uh, you know, and I said, leave them people alone, Gene Deal. Choke, no joke is a stand-up dude, just like Gene Deal's stand-up dude. But what Gene Deal to understand is, don't be fucking stupid. As the mafia say, don't be fucking stupid. You're not dumb, Gene Deal, but I want you to see the reality of this situation. See, I know what you're feeling. You, you got this... Publicity, cameras in your face, people know who you are, they recognize you, 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 you know, you got this attention, and it feel good. It feel good, don't it? It feel good that, that you get all this exposure, attention, and, and Gene Deal, I saw you before all this happening. You look better now. You look thinner now. There's no shame, brother Deal, if you need the money. New York, a one-bedroom apartment is $2,500. 
there's no shame, brother, brother Gene Deal, there's no shame if you need extra money. There's no shame in that. But don't let your mouth write a check that your butt can't cash. Because Gene Deal, these brothers ain't playing. For the accent, get this hat. Get this hat. Y'all like this hat? You need a haircut like one? Who said that shit? Who said that? Who said that? You need a haircut. You need it. You need it. Nigga, what? Bitches. Anyway, get you one of these, guys, for the action. This is a real hat. And the price of it is, was it? $35? $35. $35. For a hat, do you bang it to the left or do you bang it to the right? See, I'm a neutron. I can bang my shit to the left. I can bang my shit to the right. I can bang my shit like this. Don't be fucking stupid, Gene Deal. If you need the money, there's no shame in that. See, people rooting for you to tell, expose demonic people, protected people. You have a choice, brother Deal. You want to live to be an old hero or a dead warrior? That's your choice. <laughs> see, I see through you, brother. And I'm only speaking the truth. I will talk to you. I will go live one-on-one. -on -one, but whatever someone is saying about me, what I'm saying about you, Gene Deal, it's a lie. You know I speak the truth. You know I speak the truth. But again, to my niggas, to my bitches, worldwide, in the hood, from the East Coast, West Coast, you're surveyed, Gene Deal is now a target. Stop encourages man to make videos that is going to possibly get him killed or injured or, or worse or incarcerated. That's the breakdown. Gene Deal, you woke up a giant. You never had a problem with your internet service. I watched that video, Choke No Joke, that you did about a month ago. It started scrambling, acting crazy. Choke No Joke didn't do that. Not one of Choke videos messed up. When G Deal videos start shutting off, acting crazy, I said, oh, damn, they own this man ass. I know what it sounds like when my phones are tapped. I know when people on my ass. I know how they get down. That's why I said, I'm out. I'm out. Let them have it. Do you. Knock yourself out. Because I'm going to tell you something out there. Anytime you interfere with a person who's eager to seek, deceive, destroy, kill, or whatever, is a force to reckon with. Don't be stupid, Jane Dale. Don't be stupid. Write your cookbook. Tell good stories about artists. Stop this. Because always remember, to everyone out there watching, always remember, there's warning before destruction. This is the enlightened one, a.k.a. God's child. Peace and blessings. Gotta go. Shout out to everyone. I love you out there worldwide. Peace and blessings. Peace and blessings. Gotta go. Do me a favor. Smash that like button. Smash that subscribe button. If you're new to this channel, smash, smash, smash. Message.